political leaders welcomed the new appointments in Prime Minister Datuk Sri Najib Tun Razak's cabinet lineup. Datuk Sri Hishamuddin Hussein, who retains his defence minister post, says it is Najib's prerogative to appoint anyone he wishes. Sama seperti pandangan saya tadi, ini hak Perdana Menteri dan uh, ini keputusan uh, yang, yang amat berhormat PM. Kita ke, I, I told you it's a, it's a responsibility whether I stay or I don't stay and we just carry on our responsibility for the people and for our nation and that's the best I can say for, for the time being. But I'm relieved I'm still here. Sarawak Chief Minister Tan Sri Adnan Satam is happy that Sarawak politicians Datuk Sri Dr Wan Junaidi Tuan Kujafa and Tuan Masir Anak Kujat were appointed as Natural Resources and Environment Minister and Deputy Home Minister respectively. I have no comment to make at this time. I will make some comment after the after I, I know all the full the full facts. Enough for me to say now, and I'm very happy to see that my MP, that's the one the lady, is now a full minister. And that my very good friend, Masih Kudat, is also a deputy minister. Amno Wanita Chief Datuk Sri Sharizat Abdul Jalil says the Wanita Wing will continue to support Najib and his new team. Uh, for the for the appointment or that, whether you whether anybody likes it or not, the Prime Minister has got the prerogative. Well, you know, uh, the political ecosystem is always volatile. You know, uh, you know, as a politician, I have been through a lot myself. You know? I have learned in all the years, you know, that I've been in politics, it is volatile all the time. You know, politics is volatile. So I always remind myself, Anita. If you want, you know, a peaceful ecosystem, politics is not for you. I said, for us, we want to have on record, you know, Nasir Muhyiddin has been, you know, his jasa, banyak jasa. I was uh, selaku timbalan uh, Perdana Menteri dan kita amat menghargai. Sama jugalah kepada apa, Datuk Sri Syafiq Abdal. Eh? In Najib's cabinet announcement, he sprang a few surprises by dropping former Deputy Prime Minister Tan Sri Muhyiddin Yassin, Rural and Regional Development Minister Datuk Sri Syafiq Abdal, Natural Resources and Environment Minister Datuk Sri G. Palani Will, Science, Technology and Innovation Minister Datuk Dr. Yvonne Ibin, and Domestic Trade Cooperatives and Consumerism Minister Datuk Sri Hassan Malik.